Now for Leicestershire. We have two uncompleted mysteries. One is here, the other one is here. Okay. Very peaceful. What do I have to do? Have I lost my touch? Am I cursed? I... I just can't get it right. Stupid. You're stupid. Or fool. That's what it is. You think you know what you're doing, but you don't. What is he doing? Looks like buttering some bread. <laughs> what? Sauce results. What's this? What do I have to do? Have I lost my touch? Am I cursed? Oh, smells good. Oh, please. I'm irritated enough already. The last thing I need is someone lying to my face. It is a compliment, Saxon. Take it. What are you brewing, anyway? I call it Leicestershire sauce. That is a mouthful. What is wrong with it? It doesn't come close to meriting such a sizable name. That's what's wrong with it. <laughs> and I've tried. Lord, have I tried. But I cannot, for the life of me, strike the perfect balance. I should just give up. As I look around, that is hard to argue. You wouldn't happen to be carrying a kneel, would you? What do you know? I am. Oh, really? My word. Is this the Lord answering my prayers? They sounded more like rants. Toss it in the pot, will you please? I've fished everything in Leicester, but the eel. Perhaps this elusive river snake has been the answer to my sauce woes all along. You, high, you have too high of, an, of expectations of yourself. Lower your expectations uh. and you'll be happy. <laughs> ah, here it is. Would you be so kind? You want me to taste this? Oh, of course, no. for your palate is far less tainted than mine. Take a generous amount, too. And? Verdict? Oh, no. Not quite there. Oh, Lord! If it helps, I've had worse. Oh, I suppose that's it, then. It's over. Time for me to pack up my things and see what the fruits of another kingdom might offer me. Where will you go? Worcester, I think. Though I'll be buggered if I'm going to name my sauce after that paltry place. <sighs> Thank you for all your help. I don't know many Danes, and I don't care to, but you've helped bring closure to this journey. If I could ask one more favor of you, it would be to take this failure to the grottoes below my home. I can't stand the sight of it. Farewell. Luck be with you. You will need it. Oh, okay. This is in reference to the Worcestershire sauce. Um, or what they call it uh, today, the Worcestershire sauce. Huh? So I'm just going to take this down below your house, okay. How do I get downstairs? Wilfred's Journal. In my travels throughout the kingdoms, it was in a small corner of London that I came across the highly sought after garum. It is, for lack of a better term, outrageously delicious. It reaches every corner of the mouth, digging its hooks in and leaving you to lick your lips raw. I must attempt a version of it. A source of equal or better quality of my own creation. I will prove to mother and father that this obsession is a healthy one and it will merit reward. Yeah. Yeah, good luck. I mean, the Worc Worcestershire sauce is highly regarded, even though it's just some soy sauce knockoff. With its abominations, I've begun to experiment with some of my failed sauces. Perhaps some fermentation will lead to a better result. It is worth a try, the only problem being the stench. This is why I've decided to store them below. Here's hoping I can make something out of nothing. 
Yeah, usually fermentation <laughs> does stink a little bit. That's completely normal. Well, it was not for a lack of trying. This the only thing that reminds me of in London is the stupid warehouse where it's just so awful smelling. But these are not too bad, huh? Okay, I did what you asked me to do. Oh, look at that, another church. I wonder. What are they doing? Are they planning? Something bad. I need a key. Survey the area, Sunan. Why is the key lying around like that? Ladies, do you need any help? Don't you know it's forbidden to consort like this under God's roof? Take what you want, heathen. Just leave us be. You must be the abbess here. Why do you hide in a musky old church? We are not hiding. We sought to flee the Shire in the midst of this ungodly war. But in our haste to leave, I lost my crozier, fell into the hands of some guards in a camp just below. And I am not leaving without it. Dangerous endeavor for three sisters of the cloth. What is your plan? You're going to bore them with Bible passages until they give it back? Do not be afraid or discouraged, for the Lord your God is with you wherever you go. <laughs> it just may work. Or better yet, I can get your crozier back. You would help us? Merchant soldiers make good practice. And now I'm invested in your plight. Lead the way. What kind of war is oh. this about? And what's a crozier exactly? How long since you fled the Ministry? Must be weeks now. We had no plan and no help. We just knew we had to get out of Leicester, Whether it is Burgred on the throne, or one of yours. Makes no difference. Their reign would be less than godly. No offense. None taken. Hmm. But Muslim soldiers, aren't they like Christians as well? Oh, ladies, do you want to be a little bit more stealthy? Best not to draw attention. This is the camp. One of them has my crozier. Okay. Do I need to kill every one of them to find out which one has your crozier thingy? I am out of arrows. <laughs> mm, ladies, you might want to get away from there.
Best stay sharp. Okay, I think that's everyone. No, it's not. The Abyss's cross here should be somewhere in this camp. Mongrel! Oh no. Ladies, what are you doing? Let me handle this stuff. I think that's everyone. Crozier, I have it. Let's go! Down to the river! Wait, wait, wait. There's a chest. You are unlike any sisters I've seen. Bare fisting armed men like that. I can do all things through him who strengthens me. We Christians take matters into our own hands well enough. Crazy. Lincolnshire is on the other side. You ladies are crazy. Know that. Whoa. Oh, damn. Not today, Not today. <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> ladies, why are you chasing that wolf? Don't chase it. What? Let's cross, sisters. Now I've seen everything. <laughs> you ladies. God can only protect who protects themselves, okay? That is far enough. Sisters. Gather around. Let us pray <laughs> to the Lord our God and thank him for watching over us. Uh, lady, I am watching over you, not your God. You're Crozier. The Lord sent me a shepherd to help lead my flock today. Thank you. You did not have to do what you did. There's truth to that. You would have done fine on your own. I will never look upon sisters of the cloth the same way after today. And I will never look upon heathens the same way. Farewell. Oh, that's nice. Sisters of the Axe. Yeah, we should do all do more to understand each other. A little bit more. The world isn't just black and white, huh? Okay, that's it for Lady Chestershire. Grand Bridge Shire, only one mystery left, which is a sacrificial altar. Which is fine, don't need to do that. Essex is f done, Oxenoford Shire is done. Gloucestershire, three. Two of them. Stone stacking puzzle, which is fine. One sacrificial altar. Okay. So nothing left there. Hampton Shire, we have two mysteries left. One is a stacking stones puzzle. The other one on this island here. Interesting. Do I have all the viewpoints now, actually? Seems like it, right? Oh, 
Okay. Hold on. Yeah, okay. Let's fast travel here and get to the island using our ship, I guess. Here we go. Wait, this statue is a part of the of the puzzle. Uh oh. What did I do? <laughs> Sorry, I panicked. Kind of hazard wave. They can't reach me here, fortunately. So I need to be above a certain level, not to get completely swallowed by the by the wave, hazard wave. Oh, that was close. No way the statue is real life, right? It's glitching out. <laughs> hmm. Why are there two possible paths? Okay, I can't go anywhere from here, huh? Oh. Okay. Interesting. Oh, but I can't jump this far either. Hmm. What do I do oh. here? Oh, wow. Not sure. This looked like a glitch. Not sure if this was planned. Okay, let's wait for the next wave and then we can do the jump, I think. Okay. Whoa! That wasn't it. Uh oh. The wave, the wave is coming. No! Oh, this was so close. Okay, let's do it. Sauce. Oh god damn it, that was the <laughs> Oh, but I'm not dead. Wait, I didn't even need that, did I? Uh. 
Can I climb this natural structure? Yes, Basin can. <gasps> that is not what I wanted. Mysterious voices this time. Ah, be Basim. Okay, wow. I can rotate this. Hold on, what do I need to do here exactly? <laughs> well, optimally, I would materialize all of the blocks here, but I don't, I don't think I can do that. This light source is just pointing to nothing, which is not efficient, so maybe I should handle that light source first. Here we go. So optimally we would materialize, materialize one block that the splitter cannot get. Oh my god, these are moving around. Okay, one is moving around, the other ones stay put. I guess this needs to be down at the bottom, I think. Otherwise, I can't get up, can I? Wait, I can get up here. Okay. No more moving blocks above us, so... I guess I'll do this. Oh, I can't, I can't reach that. Okay. Never mind then, never mind. I suppose let's pin this down here. Actually, that's a bad idea. Is it? No, it could be a good idea. Could be. <laughs> Hold on, I need this block. Okay. Gotcha. I need this block. Okay. So I will point this here and use the splitter to pin down these other two blocks. <laughs> mm -hmm.
Yes. Exactly like this. Now I can also play with this light source. But I don't think there's anything to play anymore. That's uh. it. Oh, what? Wait, what? Wait, what? Okay. Maybe the block will move. What? No! Oh, wait. That's perfect! Oh wow, that's very nice level design. Although that is that wasn't what I intended due to the level design, it's exactly what I needed. Wow. Amazing. Okay, the game just crashed mid-puzzle and I had to do this whole thing again, which annoyed me to no end. What's with these crashes? I feel like it has been yeah, getting worse and worse since the last update, last patch. Here we go. Still no mysterious voices. I guess I can't make it there, okay. Yep, 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 yep. Huh. Okay, the hazard thing is... Quite dangerous, huh? Okay, I kinda need to seek shelter on these islands. <laughs> I don't know what to call them. On these uh, side islands, blocks, uh. something. The mad I'll one. Remember, they are burned into my brain. How long till you rebirth? You must wait in your endless present, and I will sail the black sea of Nombeen. But if all goes well, I'll find you again on the far side of our doom. We'll be together again. Right, uh, the mad one is probably Odin, and his trusted aid is everyone but Loki, right? So if this person is complaining about Odin, then this person must be Loki, I guess? And he's trying to find a way to survive the catastrophe as well. Of course he is. Now why the hell can I not jump onto that platform? Thank you, Bazaar. Thank you. 
now it works. Okay, now. Huh. Holy crap! I didn't think this was so close. Now, where can I seek shelter next? Doesn't look like there's anything there for me. Do I need to be quick then? Is that it? Oh no, I can just dangle from the side, right? Like this. Only works with the big blocks though. Oh, I'm out of danger zone. And here, the fragment of an ancient memory. Okay, didn't quite get what was happening there. There was one person sitting on a chair, and that's it. Hmm. A little bit untidy. Show me what lies ahead. Okay, so now the last mystery left in Hamptonshire would be this one, which we won't do. Okay, that's fine. We have all the mysteries in Kent, in Sussex. Five mysteries left. That's a lot of mysteries. Oh, oof. Okay, this is nearby. Hello? Oh, there's someone here. It's not abandoned. You're mining here. There are a lot of people mining here. Okay. There's a treasure here. Titanium? Only four, really. Okay, I guess we'll find some tablet here. Is this the entrance? This is probably the exit. What is happening here? Here? This is an exit again. There's fire around here. Doesn't that mean someone has been here before, recently?
Okay, I need to shoot that first. Gotcha. <laughs> Do I care about the treasure? Not really. <laughs> Some dead person. <laughs> More dead people. Well, guess I can't turn back now. That's probably, yeah, looks kind of an abandoned section of the mine. <laughs> Wait, what about my treasure? This is not the exit. Let's see what lies in store. Oh, okay. Another puzzle. The cauldron of Durnwich, the giant. To claim the giant's vessel, you must be as brave as he. Plunge like salmon where iron thrives, and hold that which gives you life. Sounds like I have to do some kind of leap of faith. Or just dive, that's also. There's nothing here, right? Okay, I guess I need to dive. Okay, now I'm on the other side. Uh, great. What about now? I came from here. That's bad. Let's try again. gonna make it holy crap yeah. <laughs> oh that's the tablet Good question, Eivor. Good question. Cauldron tablet. Oh, I can't. 
had to wait from here. Okay, our next stop would be this one. That's so far away though. Hmm. Maybe I can go to the coast and use my ship. Okay, here we go. Seems to be another animus anomaly. I think this is the last one. If I'm not mistaken. Some kind of slide, okay. Let's do this, I guess. Um, uh, wow, that was close. Okay. Why did I need to get to this light thing? Do I want to materialize this one? Okay. Uh oh. Holy crap. That worked. Oh my god. How is this supposed to work? <laughs> The control I have when the character is sliding is not that much. Start again from, from the beginning. This kinda sucks. Oh god! 
More surprises. Okay, I need to time this correctly, I guess. Damn, I was too slow. Interesting. So Loki, Loki's lover is that Jotun, right? Um, and it seems like he, Loki, put um, the Jotun inside something that is not a body, but she still has a mind, apparently. What am I gonna do here? What's the point here? Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Build a bridge. Like this. Nice. Okay, this should be it. No more surprises, right? Fragment of an ancient memory. Odin?
is done. Now, to face our end. What we saw, that was, they were Isu, definitely Isu, they were Odin and Loki, we could see exactly. The scene was the same that Evo saw in his dreams, the, the Ragnarok vision he had in his dreams, well, that Odin had in, in his vision while, while, while Evo dreamt of it, something like that. It was exactly the same, but like real in this Isu setting and not fake like how Evo dreamt it. Interesting. Hmm. And what we found out is okay, somehow this Isu tech didn't need. The, the life tree is apparently some machine that injects whatever DNA, Isu DNA, inside these babies, human babies. I don't know what that was all about. So, I guess so. Odin and everyone can. I don't know. Um, reincarnate, something like that. Is and and Odin didn't want to um, didn't want to give Loki this opportunity to reincarnate, but Loki somehow did manage to get a hold of the mead, so to say, by killing one of the other Isus and taking his place. Okay, that's very interesting. So, reincarnation wise. And and what I what I thought was peculiar was and it didn't I didn't even realize till now is Loki had the same voice as Basim. Right? He sounded they sounded like the same. So this made me think that what if Basim is the reincarnation of Loki and Evo is the reincarnation of Odin, probably. Sigurd is the reincarnation of Tyr and Svala reincarnation of Freya. Maybe. And yeah, and and of course Loki wants to kill Odin because Odin killed Loki's son. He widowed his destiny. Odin was someone Loki trusted with anything, and Odin betrayed him by killing his son. Oh wow. Oh wow. 
But what about Loki's lover, the Yotun? Or was it a Yotun at all? I mean, in reality, there are no Yotuns, right? I'm not sure what a Yotun are to represent. Oh, sorry, lady. Sorry, good man. Benton! Benton! Jesus Christ! Benton! Uh, did you talk about wolves? Do you want to talk to me? He went off to the north somewhere. Okay, I'll look for him. Don't worry. North. Uh oh, wolves nearby. Lots of them. Wow, someone killed a wolf. Was it Fenton? How long do you want to make me go north, game? Basin? Didn't he take... Didn't he put his lover inside somewhere in material? Oh, a note? Great Ostara, last month you gave me the greatest gift imaginable. A beautiful baby girl whom I called Ostrich. Ostrith? In your honor. I could not have imagined that nine months after I engaged all night in the sacred ritual would this wonderful gift be mine. My husband loves her dearly, watches her closely every day, says how miraculous it is that her hair is the color of the dying sun as we are both dark as the night. Perhaps I will come to you again, and you will grant me a son. May the wisdom of the ancient fathers and mothers continue to live with it. Live in you. Okay. Sounds suspicious. Hello. Hello. Fenton? Are you okay? Holds no magic. Besides, there are wolves, big ones with teeth. I'm going to that stone, and you cannot stop me. Why do you quarrel? Because my husband has the courage of a quivering dormouse. All I ask for is a child. I'm not sure how I can help you with that. There is a rock, a place of great power. They say that all women who spend the night there come away pregnant. From a rock? From the fertile power and energy it holds. I must see it for myself. Will you protect me on the road? Okay. Every woman I know who's gone to the rock has left with child. It's a miracle. And this is not a Christian belief. The legend says that Ostera, the goddess of spring, transformed a bird into a hare at this very spot. The hare then laid colored eggs for her festival. 
The place has great magic. Birds becoming hares, hares laying eggs. Well, we Norse have stranger stories. Here we are. Hey, yeah, I killed all the wolves already. Have you seen Fenton? Like a young boy, presumably? No, that's fine. This is the sacred place. I loved how Eivor um, heard she wanted to become pregnant and he said he didn't know how to help with that. Come on, Eivor. Yep, we were, we've been here before. Great Ostara, bestow your blessing upon me. Give me that which I so desperately desire. A child. Ostera shall grant your wish through the power of a sacred ritual. Do you both seek the goddesses? Saka? <laughs> this woman has come to take in the power of the Rock of Fertility. And she will all leave satisfied. However long it takes, and whatever is needed of me, I will give it. Oh. Eivor, <laughs> standing there so clueless. Uh. Many women come here. Oh. Are there cuckoos in the nest? A lot of women have had their greatest desire granted. What is so big? <laughs> Okay, I'll leave you be. I'll leave you be. Okay. Have fun. Have fun. Yes, my dear. Feel the power of the goddess. <laughs> Take it all in. But it is so big. Uh, so big. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Uh, what about Fenton? <laughs> Totally forgot about him. Okay, let's try this again, shall we? Looking for Fenton. I looked it up. It seems like Fenton is supposed to be a sheep. So yeah, that's probably that Fenton. Sounds like a sheep, not a happy one. Oh come on! will be torn apart if I do not do something. Yeah, I'm 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 doing something. Oh no. Holy crap, this looks like I'm butchering the sheep. Are you Fenton? Your master is calling you. Maybe it will come if I whistle. Oh, whistle? Okay. Hold on, I'm just gonna gonna uh, get the loot it works the sheep follows my whistle does it seems like Lucky it. I came along when I did I don't much like wolves either I wonder what the east to equivalent of a wolf is Odin was paranoid about something right or do east have wolves Come on, let's get you home. You do want to be home, don't you? Here you go, good man. I brought back Fenton. There you are, Fenton. You have escaped for the last time, you walking mutton chop. Hold still, you woolly git. Uh, 
What you doing? I went through all that just so you could kill that poor beast. What? A man like me can ill afford to slaughter a sheep for bittles, but the elderman demanded it, and I must obey. Between you and me, I've been dying to murder this bastard for ages. Fenton was a royal pain in my ass. Still, you did me a good turn, stranger. Take some meat for your help. The elderman won't miss it. It's mutton stew for me tonight. Farewell. Why did you name your sheep then? Don't name your sheep when you when you're trying to kill it. Jeez. That's some psychopath right there. 